Welcome back, folks, to the Everglades for Everglades Exploration 1. Now, all these fish can be caught basically in the same spot. I will show you where that is. And you're going to want to use a number 4 uh, with blood worms on a float pole 20 inches down or 50 centimeters for almost all of these. Um, now, with that being said, if you are doing your missions and you have some issues getting certain ones, I will tell you how to catch each one of them individually if one of them is being particularly hard. Uh, for example, uh, bluegill. If you have an issue with the bluegill, you can use mayflies. If you have an issue with the golden shiner, you can use semolina balls. Uh, the warmouth and the oscar will be very easy to catch. You should not have an issue with that, but you can also use red worms for them. The bullhead, you're actually going to want to switch your pole to blood. And for the red ear sunfish, you can catch it normally. Um, but with that being said, you could put blood or maggots on for the red deer if you are struggling. And you're going to catch all these here at the floating thickets. You're going to want to come up right here. And you can cast out right to here and here. Um, and then the red ear are actually in the middle over here right there. And then just keep in mind right over here is, uh, in the same location. And I will show you these marks. If you switch to blood... You will get the brown bullhead quite easily, in fact. And uh, the marks are uh, 37, negative 2, uh, 39, 5, and for the red ear is 17 and a half by 5. Hopefully this helps you out, guys. We'll see you next time. Have a good one, folks.